Matunga is a locality in the heart of Mumbai city towards downtown Mumbai. It is serviced by the Matunga Road station on the western line, Matunga on the central line and King's Circle station on the harbour line. Matunga has a large population of South Indians, especially Tamil Brahmins who have been residing here for several decades. An effect of this has been a good number of traditional South Indian temples and restaurants serving authentic South Indian dishes. In the heart of Matunga, there lies a small but very famous South Indian restaurant which is well known for its mouth-watering South Indian dishes. यहां पे जो लाइन लगती है ना अभी तो जो लाइन कम है सुबह हर बजे आते हैं ना जो मॉर्निंग वाले आते हैं फायर वाले वो हम मॉर्निंग वाले के सब यहां पे खाना खाना पड़ता है इसमें क्या है कि कोलकाता में जाएंगे पंजाबी ज्यादा है क्यों है तो वहां पे हम लोग एक एक आदमी आया और सबको लेके आ यहां पे जो साउथ इंडियन जो आने शुरू हुए ना ये इसमें स्पेशली बात है सब ब्राह्मण ब्राह्मण जितने वो सब इधर हैं तो इधर उनके आने से क्या होता है कि सब उनका मौत जीता है सब आ गया उनको सब कुछ यहाँ मिलता है ना मंदिर भी मिलता है होटल भी मिलता है रहने को भी जगह मिल जाती है तो तो यहाँ पे आएंगे ना डोसा में अपने पास मैसूर ऑनियन डोसा है नीर डोसा है मैसूर ऑनियन रवा है उलंदू डोसा है बस बाकी बटर सादा चीज सादा मैसूर सादा Despite the changes in Matunga's topography over the years, Matunga Food Market is still the reference point for those driving to this part of the city. A nod to its existence that has spanned decades. The flower market was once exclusively occupied by migrants from Tamil Nadu. At present, although the workers are from West Bengal, the ownership continues to be rooted in the southern state. Snippets of Tamil fall within earshot of passers-by as they negotiate a safe crossing on the busy road. The oldest South Indian temple in Matunga, the Sri Rama Mandir, is nestled in the midst of the busy shopping area by a famous flower market. But step inside the temple and you will be enchanted by the peaceful yet vibrant atmosphere. This temple has come a long way from being just a portrait of Lord Sri Ramachandra which was adorned in 1923. The successive decades, stone idols of Lord Ram, Sita Devi, Lakshman, Hanuman, etc. were installed and eventually encased in gold. Daily rituals here are strictly based on the scriptures. The mandir is more popular with Keralites. However, it welcomes anyone and everyone who would want to pay their respect to Lord Ram and the other deities. I am a Tamil artist. 
साउथ अभी साउथ इंडियन का ये मंदिर साउथ इंडियन का कल्चर से चल रहा है साउथ में तंजावुर करके गांव है उसका तो ऐसे ही चल रही है और आप कितने साल से हैं यहाँ पे मैं सात साल से ये तो तीस साल से Since South Indians are famous for their sarees, in this locality there is also the famous store Nalli that is synonymous with South Indian sarees. The store does indeed have a spectacular collection from contemporary lightweight sarees to heavily embroidered traditional silk ones. The price of the Kanjivaram saree increases with the amount and type of zari work involved and one can also shop for jewelry here. एटी वन से हम लोग का चालू होता है इधर नाइनटीन एटी वन और आप कब से काम कर रहे हैं एट्टी नाइन से कर रहे हैं एटी नाइन से और बॉम्बे से है नहीं हम लोग का नेटिव प्लेस चेन्नई ओके चेन्नई कांचीपुरम का ही है कांचीपुरम में हम लोग का वेविंग सेंटर है साड़ी से बनाते हैं वो सेंटर से हम लोग कितना आए हैं अच्छा हम लोग का थोड़ा तो नॉलेज है ना साड़ी कैसे बनाने का Giri Trading Agency Private Limited is an Indian retail chain selling religious products. Giri Trading Agency Private Limited began in Matunga, Mumbai in the 1950 when TVS Giri decided to start the business of buying and selling books through a tiny outlet. At this place one gets all the possible authentic South Indian items. Matunga ga why it is Matunga we don't know it's like Malad why is Malad more Gujarati than Malad it's they've just moved in so each area but Matunga has got a lot of south indian culture the temples the restaurants the people you know there's so much of in uh, so much of culture in this in uh, Matunga and south indians have the maximum culture i mean i feel it's you know, i'm not prejudiced every 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 uh, religion has its own culture but i think south indian culture has has got is really grown and when it comes from temples onwards to our dance dancing institutions to our musicians to all the music there are people learning violin classes rhythm gum classes singing classes Everything is happening in Matunga. Like it is, it is the cream of South India is in Matunga.